Ladies and gentlemen, please welcome Sewing Machine Choir performance artist, Carl Cadwell. Uh, hi everyone. The, <laughs> the first thing I want to do is kind of warn you that there are going to be a lot of flashing lights during the next uh, 10 minutes or so. So uh, if that sort of thing bothers you, you might want to cover your eyes or just step out for a little bit. Uh, but I just want to give a short explanation of what you're going to hear. Uh, I am a sound sculptor and musician, uh, a noise, kind of, I love noises basically is what I do. Um, Bernina asked me to create and perform a song using sewing machines and sewing machine noises. And I said yes before I knew what I was going to do. Uh, and I thought about it, they, and they said yes, and I, I thought about it, and I thought, man, sewing machines really don't make that kind of, that many noises, it's kind of a new world for me. But as you guys probably know, I was completely wrong about that. <laughs> I went to the Bernina store in Chattanooga, where I live, and Bill uh, is a guy there who really helped me and Josh, my percussionist friend, find some really amazing noises. Um, we poked and prodded and like turned and took them apart and we just like violated these things, <laughs> making all these noises. Pretty sure Bill was able to put them all back together, so no worries there. But I'm going to demonstrate really quickly just a couple of the sounds that we got, um, so you'll know what you're hearing in the song. And I got my little controller here. That's the sound of, uh, it's very barbaric, we just took a sewing machine and slammed it on a desk. <laughs> that sound, that's the sound of a pedal. Um, being depressed like a foot pedal, and then we hit and plucked the uh, needle. I got some nice kind of uh, cowbell kind of sounds. Uh, and then we, we even did some things that are a little bit more complicated where we put a stick inside where the gears are and turned the knob. I'm sure there's a name for that uh, knob, but I don't know it. But turned the knob and got like that kind of sound. So those are some nice percussive sounds. Um, and then there are even some of these machines, like these, this 8 series. I had no idea outside of factories this, this existed, but they sew by themselves. It's really crazy to me. I mean, I know for you guys this is like everyday life. But for me, I was just watching this mesmerized. Uh, we, I got some beautiful sounds like this. Uh, that's the sound of like, you know, it's like going brrrr, that. But when I heard that sound, I thought that was beautiful because I can hear that that's a note. And so I changed that pitch a couple times. I can get some melodies going. So that kind of gives you an idea of, of what I did to the sounds. Um, and you're, there's lots more sounds that we got. I don't have time to go through all of them, but you will probably recognize them. Uh, about, they'll start off very raw, and then as the song goes on, they get more and more twisted and, and warped. And uh, yeah, and then another thing that happens about halfway through is I found some old Bernina infomercials from the 2000s, 2010s. Uh, <laughs> Very old ones. <laughs> Sorry. Not, not that old. Uh, but I, this, is, this is after me looking at Bernina's things for, you know, I was looking like, okay, this year, last year was all this stuff. And I finally found some that were really golden. I put them, I sampled them, put them in here, uh, use a bow coder, twist them around. And uh, yeah, it's going to be four minute light and uh, sewing machine ride and I hope you enjoy it. Let's uh, get the lights down and get started. Bernina, made to create. <laughs> 